What's up boys and girls, this is your boy Curtis Miso coming in hot with another video and we are bringing you, we are bringing what the people want, more NBA hoops, more, this is more like what I want, but but you guys are, are going to be watching it, so I've got three more of these uh, hanger boxes, I've already ripped over $1,300 of NBA hoops premium, did a financial recap, uh, that was one of our more pop popular videos of, of, of the channel. I brought in a lot of new subscribers um, and, and so really hoping that we can continue to uh, build the channel out. I always forget to ask for people to like the video if they enjoy it. Um, so please please do that um, if you if you like the content that we're putting out. It isn't cheap to rip all this product, although I'd, I'd be doing it anyway, but uh, um, I enjoy making the videos for your viewing pleasure. So if you like what you see, please throw a like. And also, it'd be great if you could subscribe. We, we do rip a lot of product on this channel. We ripped over five, maybe close to $10,000 of Prism Football on the channel between myself and Gibby. Um, and and so it'd be great if we could, uh, you know, we're only, we, we've gotten up to over 50... 50 subscribers, which is which is pretty cool. Obviously, not a big accomplishment um, uh, to to any of the big YouTubers out there, but it, it means something to us. And it'd be cool to get that up to over 100. Maybe we could do a. I think we'll do a giveaway as, or some, of some sort when we get to 100 subscribers. But um, obviously, that's still not that many. But hopefully, on our way to to more than that. Um, so so would would appreciate some some likes and subscribes if if possible. But with that said, we'll get right into the rip, and we are looking for. I've still got my cards here from the from the last three um, uh, boxes, and I, I did pull some some nice stuff, but I I am hiding the hits, so you can you can see those hits. I hit a pretty nice one. Um, you can see those hits in the in, if you go back and watch the video. But we're really looking for. I'm looking for some rookie variations, because I hit. I only opened three of these. Uh, in my out of thirteen hundred dollars, I open more megas and and uh, cello packs than anything else, and not a lot of these. And and the variations are pretty cool, and they're certainly rarer than the base rookies. Um, so so that's kind of what I'm looking for here, and and certainly seeing if I can get. Um, there's not many inserts. There's only kind of one insert per pack, uh, per uh, box. So you know, it'd be great to hit an arriving now, but probably not given how few cards you get in these, um, and certainly. See if I can get lucky and hit a numbered card or an auto, um, but but not holding my breath for that. There's we're hitting the rookies now. Kelvin Johnson, base rookie. Marcus Morris, <clears throat> Larry Bird on the tribute, and now we're getting into some parallels. Murray, silver. Goran Dragic. So there's a silver scope. These are quite rare. Um, Tobias Harris on the Purple Disco. Mella, Purple Disco. So we didn't hit a variation. Uh, Julius Randle. And these are... Oh, and there's an arriving now. That's cool. Um, not the player, not the Pelican you're looking for, but um, this is one of the cooler inserts. Um, and so these are interesting. You know, I've noticed as I opened three of these on my last rip, some of them have three or four rookies back to back and 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 a couple of them only had one rookie which is pretty brutal if you're opening you know you're spending these are really i got them for 37 but it's tough to find them for less than 40 on ebay and if you're talking about some of these boxes having only one rookie in them that is not not good value the odds of you hitting um a top rookie are extremely low when you're getting that few uh you know one rookie per per box is, can be pretty rough although um i think more of them tend to have three or more rookies than ones that have one but if you happen to hit a one of these boxes which i've hit two now oh there's something i think there's uh, that might be an arriving now it almost looks like a gold cracked ice on the back or something I think I already saw the player, though. It's not a good player, but uh, it'd be cool to hit a super shorty. Not sure what that card is. We'll find out. Wilson Chandler. Justin Jackson. 
John Collins. Clay, really wish it wasn't hurt. Love watching him and Steph play together. Lou Will, Danny Green. Markeith Morris, see if we can hit a variation here, huh? I only hit one in the first three hangers. It does seem like they're pretty uncommon. Maybe one in three is kind of the average. Al Horford, Brandon Clark on the base rookie. Naz Reed, so this is gonna be a box that has a couple base rookies. Dwayne Wade. Kelton Johnson Silver, rookie. Not who you're looking for, but that's always nice to hit a parallel. We'll count that as a hit. Parallel rookie. Eight in second year. Green. Oh, another parallel rookie. Uh, Muriel Shea. I have no idea who that is. I don't even know if I have any cards of his. That might be a... There might not be many of his rookie cards... Wow, Cameron Johnson, another parallel rookie. So this is a hot box. Uh, unfortunately, none of these are the really right rookies you want to be hitting. But, oh my gosh, fourth parallel rookie. That is crazy. That We got a lot of rookies in this box. And then a dark uh, purple disco. And then here is, okay, so it's not a gold. It's not a gold cracked dice. It is a... Uh, just a get out the way, Dennis Smith Jr. You can see I got confused by that edge looking gold. Not going to be numbered, just a silver hollow get out the way. Although, why is that? That is interesting though. See, the most of these that I've seen, this is a silver hollow that I got in the last one. This is, this has a gold tint to it. But that must just be the background of the card is that color. So, um, that was a good hanger. Um, although, again, so the first two hangers I ripped, um, I didn't hit anything of value, and then the third one I hit a pretty big one. Um, so it seems like these can be pretty hit or miss. Um, and again, no variations, though, out of those two hangers. So these rookie variations, which I think you can get one max per box, and seeming like a lot on average it's a lot less than that so those rookie variation cards um are going to be quite a bit rarer than the base rookies obviously and um should be maybe carrying they already they, they are carrying a premium price to the base rookies but maybe they should be even more premium because uh, based on my the math uh, based on the numbers from the first you know thirteen hundred dollars of product that i ripped it seems like they are printing the hell out of this product, and as they should, they're trying to make money. Um, but that means those base rookies, even for like a, the Zions and Jaws, I don't know if those are going to hold their value. So we've got something here. Uh, could just be a bent card. Could be something interesting. We'll find out. But would love to hit a variation. I like the jaw. He's doing that little lay-in. I love the Zion with the dunk. Um, that's really what I'd love to hit, but... Given the <clears throat> how few, uh, you know, I, I'm, I got 12 of these hanger boxes and it's looking like one every three boxers, boxes or so. So that is not many chances to hit uh, the big guys. Carson Edwards, base rookie. This might be a box where you only hit one base rookie. Nope. Jordan Poole. Kobe White. Tribute. Oh, we have an auto. It's a Celtic, though. We have an auto. That was the bent card. <laughs> we have an auto. And it is Brian Scalabrini. Wow. That is a brutal. <laughs> Just. Oh. Well, it's always fun to hit an auto. Um, the other auto I hit uh, in my earlier rip was uh, Markel Fultz, which actually isn't too bad uh, when you think about Scalabrini. <laughs> That's kind of just funny, I guess. We've got a silver Diallo. Green PJ Tucker. He might be on the chopping block as the Rockets fire sale their team with Harden. Jumping ship, Mark Gasol, Purple Disco, Terrence Ferguson. Zach Collins, Josh Hart, 
and cam reddish silver class of 2019 so those three hangers were pretty brutal um not going to sugarcoat it we really didn't get anything of note um we did get an auto which is always nice but this isn't going to be worth more than can't be worth more than ten dollars probably even less than that um <clears throat> So I don't even know what our biggest card would be from those, to be quite honest with you. Uh, it could be this reddish. This might be worth $3. Uh, this might be worth a couple dollars. So, um, and this was from the earlier boxes. So uh, that's how it goes, guys. It is, this is called reversion to the mean. We are not always going to hit you know, the big uh, base rookies on the parallels, and we knew that, but it would have been nice to at least get one um, variation base rookie out of three hanger boxes. Um, but we've got six more to go. Hopefully we will we'll do better in those. Um, if you are enjoying these rips, again, it would be great if you could throw a like, uh, maybe uh, pop in in the comments and say, you know, if you rip some hangers, what are you seeing in terms of, are you seeing better luck on the variations than I am? Um, um, anyway, this is Curtis Miso signing off. Thanks a lot.